Hello and welcome to another episode of Pika 8 Adventures. I am Last of Wari and this is Little Architect, a puzzle platformer made by Benjamin Soul and released in September 2019. In the elven country life is hard for architects. You have been proven guilty in a murky affair about bridge collapse and the elf king sentenced you to survive on a very small island in the acid lake of Torgrund. Of course, acid level is rising every second, and your only solution is to build tower to escape a terrible death. Thanks gods, stones are literally falling from the sky in this region, so it should not be a problem for you. Links to the game and the author's HI page are in this video's description, feel free to check them out and play on your own. Now it's time to start jumping and race high into the sky or perish in the acid sea. Okay, so we're starting and I have three hearts, that means three lives, right? Or something like that. That's nice that uh, the drop places are highlighted. And uh, yeah, we can do a couple different things like uh, building bridges and uh, platforms, but we have to fix them onto something, so I'm not sure about that right now. I'm mostly concerned about getting higher and higher because eventually uh, that acid sea will definitely catch up. It's just a matter of time. <laughs> totally, totally. So, uh, yeah, I can jump that high actually. So, maybe it would be cool to have a couple walls and then, uh, like, do a platform thing. Right? It's supposed to drop diamonds or, uh, like, gemstones or something. Because I can keep jumping while I can, but if I fall down, I get really low, and that wouldn't be a desirable thing, right? So, getting higher. And I have planks on top 5 of them, so that's my building material. Hopefully I could get more. And I can see uh, those, not birds, but monsters flying around, which is, yeah, not great. <laughs> and it breaks down, because you need the different wall. Which is a bit of a problem, we are mostly uh, jumping on top of a like, spike or a rock made of bricks, so there is no other wall at all. Not even a little bit. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, that's a little bit, but not enough. Okay, yeah, that's, that's something, okay, sure. Yeah, I suppose it works. And how about... Uh, yeah... Okay, so it works like this. In jump, I can do this. Ooh. Yeah... Now that's a little bit of a problem. How about... I want this diamond really badly. Yeah... Okay... Not everything is lost, it looks like, and nice drops, by the way, and this time I actually can do something about this. Uh, uh, no, doesn't really serve me well, but this does, so that's not bad, but spikes are kinda pretty bad, as bad as it can go, besides dying. Yeah, just get out of here and get higher and higher and more of this. <laughs> Guys, I have a word for them, but I don't want to use it. <laughs> because it may not be Super PG-13. Well, yeah, I could try to get those diamonds down there, but it's just a little bit tricky. So, how... Ah, uh, no, it's not gonna help me at all. How about this? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I can see different creatures, like goblins or something. And this is a bottle, it's probably for hearts. But I have all of them, so it's not uh, my concern and I can't pick up extras. Uh, so, yeah, little platform and a little blow. I have 18 planks, so I can just ignore them for a while. Oh, no. I got hit. 
That's unlucky. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that, that, that's bad. <laughs> and you know what's worse? A couple sequential fun cups. Let's call them that. That's my score, and it's, I suppose, not terrible for a first try. Hide, gems, and uh, planks. Nice, over to Southlands. Not bad at all. I bet the game would give me extra points for picking up potions as well, but we have only got a chance to pick up one of them, and that was at the point when I was fully healed, and I cannot tell if it's actually true or not. But this little game is fun to play, and that's what matters. You could tell that the music is a little bit too repetitive. While I was concentrating on not dying, I wasn't really noticing it that much, so this makes it good enough in my books. You have seen that the stationary dangers were far more lethal for me personally, because goblins or birds weren't a real problem, but the spikes have managed to kill me really quickly. In the end, I'm giving Little Architect a definite thumbs up, because while it's a pretty simple game, it's full of the small gameplay bits to create a variety of challenges and useful things to pick up. You can tell me your opinion in the comment section down below. If you like this video, you know what to do. Sharing it on social media always helps. It was Last of Umari, thank you for watching, and hopefully I will see you later.